It is Quest High School Hockey Night, but in Egan, it is Youth Hockey Night. That's the future of this Wildcat program. For more on that, here's Marnie Gellner. Thank you, Anthony. Youth Night is a pretty big night here at Egan. And just look at these guys coming out in packs for a game like this. They're wearing their jerseys, they're showing their support, and it's all part of the process for them in becoming hockey players. And if you ask the guys that are playing in the varsity game tonight, they all remember being part of the youth hockey program. And if you ask these guys, they can't wait to be part of the big games and playing on the varsity. Let's ask Justin here who his favorite player is. Who's your favorite player, Justin? Scotty Bell, because he lives in my neighborhood. See, that's all. That's what it's about. Head coach for Egan, uh, Mike Taylor, tells us more about youth night. We wanted to get the kids in for youth night. If they wear their jersey, then they uh, get in free. Coming and watching a lot of the older guys, and we used to, uh, when we were younger, we used to look up to the high school team like they were almost like professionals, and now it's kind of nice to be kind of idolized the same way by our youth programs. I remember coming to the games when I was younger and wearing my jersey and just watching those older guys play, and I was just amazed. Kevin and Anthony, if you guys think back to about 100 years, you remember being these two. How about young Anthony LaPanta here with the dark hair all over the place? And young Kevin Gorg, the blondie, before you went with the tight cut. Right, guys? Am I right? Absolutely. Although I, I'm, a, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that that guy can skate better than a young or old Anthony LaPanta, for that matter. Our Touchstone Energy School profiles focus on the future of these programs because it's based on the success in the youth program. You look, Eden Prairie last year, won the state Bantam championship the year before they had won the state peewee championship and for egan regional qualifiers at both levels this year their peewees are ranked in the top 10. yeah both these coaches are good friends of mine loved catching up with them this evening when i got to the rank and they both talked about how excited they were both for this season but more importantly for the future